to Ketsina, where the state command of the Nigeria Customs Service has described as false, reports making the rounds that its officers extort money from granots and beans sellers along the Keita Dankama Road of the state. The Customs Area Comptroller clarified the issue in a recent parade of contraband items seized by operatives from September to date. TV News correspondent Abdul Latif Yusuf is with us. The custom area command is again showcasing items worth millions of naira to the public to serve as deterrent to the people. The seized goods on display comprise assorted food items, cars and second-hand clothes, among others. The total DPV for the bakeries stands at 59,575,000, while the general goods, 302 bags, about at least uh, about half a trailer, of 50, 50 kg foreign per boiled rice with a duty paid value of 8,964,400 naira, 361 cartons of foreign spaghetti with a duty paid value of 2,599,200 naira, as well as 30 cartons of foreign couscous with a DPB of 260,000 naira. Total DPB on these products is 18,228,000. 825 naira. When you foot vehicles and general duty all together, the grand total of the duty paid balu stand at 77 million 803,825 naira. This successful outing is marred by a video clip that went viral, allegedly implicating custom operatives in act of extortion against traders. I show the good people of Kassina State business community that we are professionals and we will not relent in discharging our mandates. All those mischief makers should allow peace to reign or face prosecution when caught smuggling because we have intensified our strategies on arresting any smuggler. The security heads in Kapila State have formed an ad hoc committee to go around the state to fish out all the bad eggs within the security agencies such as illegal checkpoints, extortion, use of convoys in discharging official duties. TBC News crew decided to dig deeper and interview some of the traders at Denkama town to ascertain the allegation. Although the traders union denied having any issues with the custom operatives, this incident should serve as warning to corrupt officers that it is only a matter of time before they are exposed. Abdul Latif Yusuf, TVC News, Katsuna.